Yeah, welcome back to y'all. It's, it's your boy Kill Joy Johnson back again with the DLW playing uh, WWE 2K20. And uh, we're throwing it down to. Uh, to. Uh, tournament mode here. And we've got ourselves a good old fashioned Dusty Rose Classic. We've got these guys set up into this matches, already set up nicely. We've got Brazongo versus fucking Red Right Raiders. We got Revival versus the Maniacs. If y'all watch DLW, you already know exactly who the Maniacs are. They come out with the fire, they come out with the the, the, the insanity. But if you also know watch WWE, you know who the Revival are. These guys are ground and pound, straight to the down, and they will they'll they'll, they'll target a party part. Break that that body part until that body part is no more a body part. So then you've got the Usos versus Mustache Mountain here, and then you know saying the Usos just coming back from a nice hiatus, taking out Mustache Mountain, which they come back together for a while. You know what I'm saying it's surprising, very surprising. And then you got the match of the night, in my opinion. You got the Cyborgs of Darkness versus the Street Profits. Now both the Cyborgs of Darkness. In DLW have been both tag team champions. I'm sorry, I'm not tag team champions. I'm sorry. Um, um, World heavyweight champion, and Rage has won the um, the TV title. So here we are with the Street Profits, who are, you know, saying tag uh, ex tag team champions, seeing someone that hasn't been tag team champions taking on a tag team champions. That's a pretty much good good matchup right there. We do not have the um, the um, XT Tag Team Champions in this one there because that makes no sense. You know what I'm saying? These guys are unnecessary in this situation. But anyway, we're going to start off with uh, Bizanga versus the Viking Raiders and see what that goes off to. And here we go, Brazongo versus the Viking Raiders, NXT in conjunction with uh, DLW gives you brings you the uh, Dusty Rose Classic. So let's get it on. comes the Dutton Cop. The following contest is a Dusty Rhodes Classic Tag Team Tournament first round match. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 456 pounds, the team of Tyler Breeze and Fondango, Breeze on go! Here they come, the Viking Raiders. Yes, you're Raw Tag Team Champions. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 552 pounds, the Raw Tag Team Champions, Eric and Ivar, the Viking Raiders! Yes, it's up to date. Here they are, 
ladies and gentlemen. Quick lock up and puts him into the nice little headlock. Spins around to the nice little arm bar, reverses it into a reverse back up, up, back into a head, but into a uh, headlock. Throws him off the ropes. Oh, a knee to the guts. Ty Breeze is on point here, waking up here, not, not giving him much time to do anything here. Woo! Super kick to the face. It's almost like a, a, a stank final shot right there. Drop kick. Ah, nice drop to the back. Attack to the back there. But he's in the wrong part of town being over there next to Ivar. He's in the wrong part of town being right there. That's, that's, that's pretty dangerous right there. That's pretty dangerous right there. Letting his opponent get that, his opponent get that close to his, opponent, his partner. That's real dangerous right there. I don't know about all that. Picks him up. Oh, atomic drop. Well, I think I, I like to call it the nut buster. Mm, nice into Gurry. Surprisingly, Tyler Breeze is holding his own against the tag team champions. Zango is holding their own against the tag team champions. Oh. He is sitting back, taking it. It's really kind of sad right now. Oh, he's just wrecking Ivar. He's just wrecking Eric apart. Move after move after move, no kind of counters at all. No kind of no kind of defensive no, 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 no kind of defense at all. Oh, now there's some offense coming from my from Eric. Woo! Slap straight to the to, to the chest. Woo! Another chop to the chest. Puts the boots to him. I uh, Viking style. Picks him up right here. Looks like it's gonna look, 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 looks like like ah oh, back body drop. Into a target suplex. Yeah, he's feeling it now. He's feeling it now. He's feeling the life. Over the belly body drop about uh, our suplex. Over the body suplex. Nice and done. That chop grabs him up, starts walking over to the corner. But Ron Corny is walking over to him. I don't know why he's taking it straight to his partner. Waiting for his as if he's, he's, he's daring the other veteran to be ready to do something. I think they know that since this is the, the Dungeon Rose classes, they're being very um, respectful. Oh, well, there, 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 there that goes. That respectful part of it, there, anyway. Oh, super kick to the face. And there's that's that part where it comes into being right next to the guy's corner. The Fandango looks like he's on that though. No, 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 Oh, misses with the forearm. But he picks him up, up against the ropes. Looks like, looks like, yep, yep, snake eyes. Oh. That's a, uh, that's a, uh. 
Oh, belly flop. Kicks it at that there. Picks him up. Ah, oh, power bomb. Chris Pretty is not looking so pretty right now at all. Tiger bomb. Yeah, and Ivar is feeling it right now. He's, he's, he's calling it done and quits. Oh, but no, Prince Pretty slides out of it quickly. Chuck rolls him up and then snap here and kicks it back to the chest. Back, 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 to the back. I'm sorry. Oh, and once again, what y'all watching right now? Y'all watching Killjoy Johnson on the mic? And we're watching the Dusty Rhodes Classic between freaking... The Zongo versus the, 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 the Tag Team Champions, the, the Wild Raiders. I'm telling you what, this match right here is pretty on point. What are you looking for? Good all darkness. I'm joking. <laughs> anyway. Oh, match four for freaking... Chris Pretty there. Oh, another one. Oh, now he's just the boost him for a second there. Well, we can't really be surprised if him. I, 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 I can't be really surprised that Chris Pretty's over here doing his damn thing against Rico Ivar. But I am surprised that there's such a domination going on here. Because Fandango is in the. Fandango hasn't even been in the ring yet. He's fresh. And here he is, Tyler Breeze, just holding down both Viking Raiders. Another stomp, another stomp, just to make sure he stayed down. But no, Ivor's not staying down. Oh! He's got time to talk to the fans. He's got time to talk shit to the fans. Tuck roll up and into a single leg Boston crowd. Single leg crowd, and he breaks it up. I, I, Eric, Eric breaks it up. Goes for the quick pen. One, two. Eric breaks it up and through two and a half. Oh, it looks like he set it up though. Fandango, Fandango takes out freaking Eric. Fandango picks up. Look like, oh, well, no, 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 no. That might have, that, that really might have hurt Tyler Breeze right there. Oh, he's going for the top rope for it. He's going to the top rope for it. What's he going for here? What's he going for here? Elbow drop off the top rope. And he's calling it. He's calling it, ladies and gentlemen. He's saying this is over. It is done and done with right now. Oh, he's waking him up. Calling for him to wake up. Jack, jacking around, jacking around, messing around. I don't know why the tag team champions are sitting there playing around with this time reason we hold him down. Oh, super kick to the face. Can he get to Fandango? Yes, he gets to Fandango. Fresh Fandango's in the ring. Oh, right, right, right hook. Comes up. Oh, Falcon Arrow suplex. Man, Nagel's feeling it. He's feeling it in the ring. He's woken up. He's here and he's here to fight. But he's taking way too much time with him, the chat champions. But Van Nagel's fresh this whole time. Tyler Breeze has been holding down both the back and the other by himself. That in itself is an amazing accomplishment. For even, even, win or lose tonight, win or lose tonight, freaking Van Nagel showed themselves to be an actual good, a good, a really good tag team, tag team to, against the Wild Tag Team Champions. But oh, oh God, oh God, really? Oh God, here comes Eric. Eric's in the ring now. Oh, and a nice freaking suplex. A snap there. Oh, elbow straight, leads him straight to the face. Staying on him, staying on him. Oh, staying on him. Oh, a chop to the, chop to the chest. And a kick to the gun on top of that just to wake him up. Kicks him up. Ah! Oh, right to the face. Count it. 
One, two, no, kicks out at two and a half. And the fans are loving it. Oh, and breaks the roll. There it is right there. The dancing man's freaking the wrestling the wrestling next week. Goes in for the pin. One, two. Ah, and Ivor breaks it up. Drop it to the back of the neck. Drop it to the back of the neck. And then, oh, oh, quick eye chop. Quick eye shot. Oh, a snap duplex. And he's calling for something. He's telling him to get up. He's calling to get up. Mmm, it's a Gurry. And a little something for the fans. Which I don't know who is asking for it. Ah, oh, a little, little something for the fans. He's just just, just gyrating, just jumping, just chopping just 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 junk. Have you ever, has anyone seen the Viking Raiders be handled like this? Especially by Brizango of all, of all tag teams. Oh, and you to guts. John was back to just talking junk. I mean, Van Dyke was just back to talking junk. Oh! A rude awakening! Oh, we're we gonna see it. Are we gonna see it? No, no. Looks like just a oh, just a good old fashioned um, spinning DDT off the off the off the ropes. Bam! He goes for it again. Ta-da! Finished it up. Is this, is this gonna be enough to hold it down? Is there, is Ivan gonna get there? Is Ivan gonna get there there? Yes, he gets there last second. Oh, and Fandango is feeling tired off of this now. He's been, he's been down. He's already put down two of his finishes to put him down. Oh, where's he going with this? What's Fandango's planning here? Superplex off the top rope. No! Not a superplex off the top rope. It converts it into a freaking Falcon Arrow mid-air. I am surprised why is he not going for the pin? Wow! Gets it with the, uh, the rolling dice. Goes for the pin. One, two, three. No! Two and a half again. Ivar is saving this matchup. They're saving this. They're saving this matchup. They're starting to stay into the Dutch Rose Classic tonight. Oh, and Eric's busted open. Snap suplex. Kick to the back of the neck. Oh, he's going for. Looks like he's going for the final. He's going for the final. Dead. No, no, just an elbow drop. Oh, runs up. Looks like it's own version of the beauty shot. One, two. Three, that's it, Brizango wins it. Unbelievable upset. Unbelievable upset. Brizango has just defeated the tag team champions, the raw tag team champions. And quite easily at that.
That was one hell of a match. Brazongo came out there tonight to actually show the damn thing, and they really did shoot the shoot the damn thing tonight. Here are your winners, the team of Tyler Breeze and Fontango. Brazongo. If you had told me that was gonna happen, ladies and gentlemen, I would have laughed you. I would have laughed you out of the room. There it is. Brazongo just won against freaking the Viking Raiders. Unbelievable. That was an upset victory if I've ever seen one before in my life. Not a quick roll up, clean. Want it clean. We're going to jump the Usos of Rizzo Rusters Mountain just because of time frame uh, restrictions. And, if, and uh, it looks like the Usos are coming up against the freaking. Alright, now we got the Revival Bridge, the Maniacs. Um, we should watch this one. But we're not going to. So we're just going to jump past this one. And the Miniacs win it. Okay, so now we've got Rizango versus the Miniacs in the semifinals. And we've got Disciples of Darkness and the Street Prophets. This, now this one I've got to play myself because this is Disciples of Darkness. Let's see if we can fasten up the momentum there. The Disciples of Darkness versus the Prophets. Here we go, here we go. Now, what my, my prediction for the finals is going to be the Disciples of Darkness versus the uh, Maniacs. That's what I think is going to happen. But you never know, Brizongo. Brizongo is the, the, the sleeper, the sleeper, the sleeper team that came out of nowhere and surprised the hell out of everybody. Plus, you can't forget the Usos are in the match too, so whoever wins this match up next. Let's take on the Usos one-on-one. -on -one. Or two-on-two, -two actually. I'm sorry. The following contest is a Dusty Rhodes Classic Tag Team Tournament first round match. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 590 pounds, the Disciples of Darkness. Tag team, the, 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 the Street Province, the former tag team champions are showing up. Oh, yeah. And their opponents, and their opponents at a combined weight, weight of 492 pounds, Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins, the Street Prophet.
See, these guys are ex-fucking tag team champions. These guys are ex-freaking, uh, well, right now they're on Raw right now. They haven't actually gotten their hands on the tag titles in the Raw yet. But after that, this whooping, I just saw that the tag team, the, the, the Viking Raiders just get, it might be a chance, that the, 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 it might be actual chance that the Street Profits walk away with the tag team belts. Uh-oh, oh, 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 looks like the, the, the boys are ready to jump. Looks like the boys are ready to jump. Oh, looks like the boys are ready to jump. It looks like the match has started off. Let's go. Let's get it on. Oh, and a bulldog from Montez. Trying to stay alive against the Reaper. Oh, trying to stay alive against the Reaper. Still hasn't dropped it to its feet yet, though. The Reaper misses. It looks like he's got something in his eye there. Oh, that, that's the next week. Oh, nice standing takedown. He's just doing wrestling moves as best as he can right now. Stay away from the Reaper. Oh, Reaper's down. Oh, yeah, hey, Montez is feeling it. Montez is feeling it for real, for real right now. How long can he keep this up, though? He has to keep the Reaper on the ground as much as he can. If he doesn't let the, the, if he lets the Reaper get the, 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 the upper hand, it's over right then and there. Uh-oh, the Reaper's got the Reaper. Reaper's got the Reaper's got the freaking counter off. Oh, a nice big, uh, big boot to the face. Oh, Superman punch. Darkness into the... Oh, into the spear. Reaper's not having that, though. Reaper's not having that, though. Where's he going? What's he doing with this? Looks like an Urinagi. Urinagi! Tags in rage. Rage comes in with a freaking with a name and oh oh Rage comes in with a double stomp to the face. Oh the spirit of Montez Ford. Now, that's usually Montez Ford's own finishing move, actually, I didn't believe. Looks up for a curb stop. <coughs> oh man. Curve stop made me feel that one right there. Oh, oh, that's his head, that's his forehead. And another freaking swanton. And another swanton. And another swanton. And another swanton. Jesus Christ. Oh, kicks it, it needs you to face. Goes for the pin. One, not even a one count. Versus out into the ropes. Throws him back out the ropes quick, smartly. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, what's going on here? What's going on here? They got a little tag team action going on here. Kick to the face and by splash. Ah, nice standing drop kick from freaking Montez Ford. But Rage drops out of it, works out of it. Looks like Rage is going for it again. Oh yeah, Rage goes for it again, but he doesn't go for the pin this time. Oh, what's he going for? The surfboard, surfboard, no, 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 no. Oh, face first into the canvas. Multiple punches straight to the face. Oh, nice standing. The best new songs ever right there, ladies and gentlemen. Is he going for it again? Yes, he's going for it again. Oh, best new song in the business. Goes him into the corner.
What are they going for here? It looks like look, look, he, he just got him up on his arms. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, damn. Looks like a burning hammer combination with a knee drop. Throws him over, flips up. Ah, oh, kick to the face. Reaper's a big boy, but he's got a lot of agility, a, 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 a lot of uh, agility to him, towards him. But he's also a big boy as well as that. Just, just, just. It's not even a move. He just let him hit him. Oh. Oh, Rage is not going to let that happen. Oh, oh, stun gun. Suplex. Into a quick slam. Trying everything he can do to keep Reaper on his off his feet. Oh. Snap suplex. Oh, Reaper re re reverses into out of it. Into a power slam. Powers him straight out of that one. Picks him up on his shoulders. Oh, nearing me and oh, suplex will follow up with it. Backhand, Jesus Christ! Threw him up at least three feet in the air. Picks him up, grabs him by the head. Oh, one, two, three, four. Five knees to the face. And another knee to the face. One suplex. He's going for this. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, what, what? No, 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 no. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. He's going for Suplex City. He's going for Suplex City. The Necropolis. Boom! There it is. Reverses out into the freaking ropes. Oh! He freaking Montez gets in. Um, um, Dawkins jumps into the match. Here comes Reach. Here comes Rage. Here comes Rage. Rage is not having it. Oh, Rage is not having it from either one of them. Rage is not having it from either one of them. Oh, this is actually this is broken down, ladies and gentlemen. This is broken down to an all-out brawl. Oh, super kick from Rage. Oh, back body drop from Rage. Was he going for no 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 next snap? Oh my God! Is this gonna end up in a figure? What's the name? And it's just yes, it's gonna end up in a, 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 a draw because these boys will not let him stop it outside the match. Oh my god, this can't end in a draw, can it? No, I didn't think it would. They, 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 they match, the match gets restarted by the ref. This is a Dutch Rose Classic. These guys did not have to happen like that. Okay, so the ref, so by order of Triple H, they restarted the match right here, right here, right now. And it looks like Reaper is not here to play around this time around at all. Oh, Reaper is not here to play around this time around at all. Look at this. His fist just blows straight to the back of his head, hurting him badly. Oh, Rage Reaper is, Reaper is pissed. Reaper is pissed, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my God. No offense at all coming out of freaking um, um, Montez Ford. 
Superman punch. Ducks into it. Into the spear. Reaper's calling for it. What's Reaper setting up here? What's Reaper setting up here? Oh no, 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 Reaper, don't do it, don't do it, no! Oh, damn! Lay it out on the outside. This time around, he's not even tagged in. He's tagged in right there at all. Once at all, in some match. Even though, even though Ray Chaz had a moment of himself and into the match itself, he has actually been actually into it since. Oh, backhand! And standing takedown just takes him down again. He's stuck his opponent. He's stuck his opponent. Turns around. Oh, Reaper is not here to play tonight. This, this time around, he is not here to play. And he's like, bring him to me. Bring him to me. Oh, oh, what's the setup for? What's the setup for? What's the setup for? Oh, needed a face! Jesus Christ! That just happened! <laughs> Woo, these guys are going at it. Balls to the wall. Oh, what's this that what's he going for here? Going for another? Uranagi! Oh, he's on top of Montez Ford like nothing. Back on him again! Really? Oh my God! He's just—he just—he just, just wants to beat this kid into into submission off of just what just happened in the, the last few minutes ago. He should just be going for the pin right here because after all that battling they went through earlier, he's, this is beyond that. This is beyond pinning. Oh, this this straight up beef right now, ladies and gentlemen. I can tell you right now, this—I know what beef looks like, and this is grade A freaking USDA grade A beef right here, right here, right now. Oh! Oh, takes out the ref! To it, throws him into the oh, into the trip ugly goes and double knees to fall boots. And he go, he calls, he said it's over. Oh, now, next snap takes out Montez Ford. I mean, uh, uh, uh Dawkins. Throws them into the ropes. Looks like they're going for it. Yeah, they're going for the finish, ladies and gentlemen. They're going for the finish right now. Ah, oh, kick the death. Goes for the pin. One, two, 
Kicks at two and a half. Oh, that buzzes him open. He is, the rage is not here to play around in today, ladies and gentlemen. This is beef right here. Squash it up. Sleeper neck breaker. Trying to put him to sleep right now, ladies and gentlemen. This is not, this is not, this is not pretty. This is not nice. This is not, this is not clean. This, this will come out to an odd war. Oh, what's he doing? No, 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 no! Don't do it, man! Don't do it, man! Remember, this is a, this match is for is for Dusty Rhodes Classic. Keep it together! Don't do it! Yes, he decided not to do it. Thank God. But if the side was to get disqualified, this far into the match after all this, there that that would just be, that would just be sad and disturbing to all the fans here at the game to watch. Need to face. Oh, it never needs to face. Fix him up. Oh, exit. He wants to get onto the outside. Oh, comes down onto him. Just working that knee now, working that knee now. This is a one hell of a first round match for this freaking Dusty Rhodes Classic. If any of the matches look like this, it's gonna be off the chain, off the way, all the way around. Ah, uh, it's got him in the, 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 the Gator Roll. Gets him into the Gator Roll, locks him up. Puts the pressure onto him, place the pressure onto him. Oh, look at that pressure. Oh, God. Stay down. He just sweat over here and just put him down just for the count, just to make sure he stayed down. And a spear on top of it just to make sure. He's going for it. Looks like he's going for it. Oh, big boot to the face. Damn. Urinagi. Oh, he set it up. He set it up. He set him up for it. Ah, oh, spirit death. gets thrown back into the ring. Oh, Reaper go 
Hogan in with a spear. He's not losing this match tonight. Kick to the face to go and finish it off. Let's do that one more time again. What's going on? Damn. One more time. Yeah, bounces up on his leg. Bow! It's a girl straight to the face. Going for a freaking finisher. Oh, that body drop. Oh, he broke it into he got he both caught he caught his partner's head when he went for that. This match has become a true slobber knocker if any I've ever seen one in my life. Kick to the face, and a kick to the face. Hold him down, hold him down this time around. Goes up for the spear once again. Ah, oh, cuts out that one. Goes for the pin. One, two, kicks out a two and a half. Like his partner is protecting his body with his own head. Oh, this is it right here. This is it right here. This is it right here. Ah, oh, Buddha death. Oh, and he's got the ropes. He's got the ropes. One, two. Oh, with the ropes, he still kicks out. Reaper's lost his mind right now. Reaper doesn't know what to do with himself. What? What? The Street Profits are showing us the best match I've seen the Street Profits in in a long time. We want to smoke. Oh, we want to smoke. Snap suplex. Rose Island wisely. 
just to jump on Mox, just to jump on Ford as soon as he comes out the ring. Oh, 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 back to the face. God, the things these guys, these guys have done to each other since the match has started. Shakes it off of him. Says it one more time. Another spear coming up from. Ah, another spear coming at him. He's going to finish it off. Wow! Is this it? Is this it? Is this gonna be enough? One, two. That's it. The Cypress of Darkness move on into the into the into the, into the, into the Dusty Rhodes Classic. What a match, ladies and gentlemen, though. Good God, what a match. Back and forth, beginning to end, draw, and restart the match. This match went to this if this if this was the finals, that would have been one of the greatest finals of ever. But again, that was just the first round match of this tournament. Jesus Christ. The final of the first round match of this tournament went all balls to the wall. Respected Street Poppers, but those are your winners. Time. That was a five star match if I've ever seen one, ladies and gentlemen. So there we are. We are in the semifinals. Rizango and the Maniacs versus Usos and the Cybers of Darkness. We'll find out who might win these two matches next time around on the next broadcast.